Okay, guys, this is Nathan, and um, this is not actually a Let's Play. Don't get too excited about this. Uh, this is a new software that I'm going to be trying out here. Um, I said before that um, I didn't have a good screen recorder for um, doing PC games, and if I did, my computer probably couldn't handle it. Um, but I found one that actually seems to be good, and it doesn't seem to take too much of a toll on my PC. Um, let me uh, change this off to peaceful here, get rid of all these mobs. This is uh, creating mode. Uh, this is me... Uh, well, this is a map I've been working on for a very long time now, just for fun. I call it Castle Land, because it is a giant castle. It's not nearly complete yet. I'll show you guys what I've got going on here. And, uh, oh my goodness, that is really close by. Let me uh, change the distance here to normal. Hopefully it will not drop too many frames. Anyway, I'm testing this out mostly to see if it would be even possible to do PC games such as Minecraft uh, for Let's Plays. Um, that's kind of my primary purpose is to see just how this, how well the software works and how well I can edit it. This is all recorded after the fact. I tried doing live voice recording and it just did not work out um, because it just it, it just dropped my frame rate so much. But, let's see, this here is my village outside of my castle. Um, I am going to build a lot more houses here. But this is where all the villagers live. There's some of them down there. I've had a hard time lately uh, keeping them in their houses because they uh, made a patch for the game that allowed the villagers the ability to open doors. Here is my moat I'm working on, and oh, that's flowing water. That's going to actually that's going to kill my frame rate right there. So I should probably get away from it. But here is my uh, wall. This is my tower for defense, and there's one of my guards. Hey there, hey buddy. Hey, where you going? Okay, you keep standing guard. You you're doing a good job. I'm proud of you. Anyway, as you can see, I have laid quite a few brick uh, on this game. <laughs> quite a few. Um, this are the guard barracks here. Yeah, we can go up here. And there's another guard. What's up? Hey, you're a healthy guy, aren't you? Alright. And there's a sheep or something down there. Anyway. Down here in the guard barracks. We have got, um, yeah, all the equipment I put in there. Got some beds for them to sleep in. Nice area here. Yeah, this is where the guards stay when they're on duty. So yeah, I just I wanted to, I'm kind of proud of this a little bit. I wanted to show off um, a little bit of what I've done, but you know it's probably not super um, impressive compared to some of the people who play this. Like I don't know, some people play Minecraft more than I do, and um, some people have built some pretty impressive stuff. Um, of course, you just go to YouTube, you see that. Um, let's see here. Here's my castle. If it'll actually load here, this is taking a while. Okay. Yeah, notice the yellow dot, too. Um, I can't get rid of that. That's just part of the screen recorder. It shows where the mouse is. Here's my fountain. Isn't that a pretty fountain? It's beautiful, I think. But let's go in. I will show you guys the inside of the castle, or at least what I've got done on it so far. I've still got a whole lot left to do on that. Um, yeah. This is the main sort of entrance for your room. Steps going up there to the top, like a balcony. Um, and I'm going to have a lot of rooms off to the side. I'm not even sure what I'm going to do with all of them. Some of them, some of them are going to be like living quarters. Some of them are just going to be just rooms for stuff. Here's my uh, tall, circular... Um, I don't even know what you call it. I'm going to put that into floors and make stairs going up to the different floors. Yeah. See, there's big sections of my castle. Whee! All right, big sections I haven't even uh, filled up yet. I haven't even walled in yet all the way. Oh, stupid glass. All right. And let's see here. You can just go up the stairs here. I'm going to be in a... Yeah, anyway. Stairs keep going up to higher floors. This is all going to be used for something. I don't know. Maybe make some into like a training room or various different things. Um, let me show you the throne room next. And close this. Oh, yeah, when my computer is laggy, I get a uh, like this double-click effect that makes it really hard to only build one of something or to close doors. Very frustrating. But anyway, got a lot of bats in here too. But through here, oh, that's pretty with the sun setting. This is the throne room. 
As you can see, the lanterns are made of torches, well, nether, nether fence and, or nether brick fence and torches and glowstone. Here is the throne. Getting a little bit of lag here. And uh, there is my kitty, hello kitty. There is my puppy, hello puppy. Oh, they're talking to me. Anyway, uh, this is the throne room. Kind of nice, kind of big, but I guess that's what a throne room is supposed to be. Um, oh, over here, I will show you guys the kitchen, and this is really, uh, yeah, this is dropping frames a lot more so than what I would like. Anyway, oh, stupid door. All right, this is the kitchen. This is where the cooks come to cook things. This is their table where they cut up stuff. That's their oven with a lot of fire in it. I should really lower the fire some so that you just see the tops of it there. That's kind of an unrealistic oven if it's just pure fire. Uh, storage sheds. I haven't put anything in there yet. Um, yeah, nothing in there. Anyway, if the cooks need some extra meat, they can come out here. Hey, look at that. Neat, huh? Yeah. This is the stable. And over here is going to be the, uh, this is the house where the stable boy stays outside here. It's not much, but at least it's something, whatever. I think by giving him housing, housing I'm justified in only paying him minimum wage. Even though he's technically non-existent at this point, I haven't put a mob down for the, uh, or well, a villager down for the stable boy yet, or for any of the cooks. But I'll show you how the cooks are doing. I'll show you where they work. Up here. Well, there's another area where they work here. See another big table here, some melons and cake over there. Another stove. Yeah. And I am a very generous person, because on this floor right here, we're getting more lag, but on this floor, this is their recreational area. They can come up here, chill, read some books, hang out, play pool. This is supposed to be a pool table. I don't really know how to make a more realistic looking pool table. Um, anyway... And up these stairs up here on the fourth floor, well, you know what would be good right here? Would be, yeah, we should put in a jukebox uh, for them. But where is the jukebox here? I actually do not remember. Uh, it's under miscellaneous. Um, sorry, my dog is barking because my wife is outside putting something in the trash. Let's see. Um, eggs, no. Where would the jukebox be? Um, it's been so long since I played this, they did it differently. Um, they've switched everything around a little bit here. Uh, this looks promising, the building button, no? Well, I don't know. Nether Quartz Ore, what is that? I don't even know. Um, man, I have not played this game in so long, it's been so bad. Um, lots of enchanted books there, oh, holy cow. That's a lot. Brewing items, okay. Materials, uh, no, it's under here somewhere. Survival inventory. Oh, that's what I have on me at the time. Um, transportation. Redstone. No. It looks promising there. I don't think. Note blocks, but there's no um, jukebox there. Hmm. Okay, what's this? Decoration blocks. Would it, yep, jukebox. Here we go. It was under decoration. How does that? No, let's see. Well, they've even changed around the method of putting out items in creating mode here. Um, yeah, get rid of this bed. I can just make a new one. And we'll put a jukebox there instead of giving them Christmas bonuses this year. Okay. And up here on the fourth floor above the kitchen area is the cook's living quarters. There are four rooms here. See, that's room number two, kitchen staff number two. And they get a bed and bookcases and a little storage shed. And that is enough for them because they are lowly servants. Okay. I'll show you just a little bit more here uh, before we finish up this tour. Oh dear, we are lagging quite a bit more now. I wonder if it's because the video file is getting bigger. Anyway, come through this hallway here, out to this section, and we have... click. This is the opening room where we were before. Um, the steps that led up to the balcony, this is the balcony here. And um, yeah, it's getting dark now. But out here is a throne room, and you get kind of a nice aerial view here of it, balcony view, good place for an assassin, I guess. Uh, so maybe that's a design flaw, we'll see. But I'll just keep it on peaceful mode, that way nobody wants to kill me. 
and come into another hallway here on the opposite side. There's some steps. We'll go up the steps and come into my room. This is where I stay as the king of this castle. And this is a very pretty room, I think. I like the the purple curtain effect. You know, purple's supposed to be the color of royalty. Like I think I'm like like I think I'm better than everybody or something. Anyway. Uh anyhow, yeah, there's my lights. Well, you know what? Let's just go ahead and go to bed since it's night. Maybe it won't lag so much in the morning. Yeah, right. And there's my uh yellow dot moving around there. Alright. And curtains there, and over here, a little card playing table. I got my bookshelves. I picture Donkey Kong and nice little hangout area here in front of the fireplace. Out here is a balcony, and that um this is the outside of my castle. Yeah, as you can see, I still got a lot of work to do, especially when it comes to, like furnishing and putting in floors and things like that. Um, yeah, floors are important, I suppose. So anyway, and this is my castle, and um, hope you guys enjoyed. Just kind of wanted to show it off, see how you guys are. So hey guys like it. So let me know, um, comment, and like I said, I can't guarantee necessarily Minecraft LPs if it's going to lag real bad, but this is just kind of a test. So I'll see you guys later. Thanks a lot for watching.